What's up, you guys? Why did you bring the weather with us? What did I do? You're not supposed to do that. You guys, we're in Houston, Texas, and it's supposed to be like, isn't it supposed to be like the state of barbecue and sunny weather? It's supposed yeah. to be warm. So, you guys, this is Grant, this is Tony. These guys work at a wrap shop called AFC Texas, right? Yes, sir. Nailed it. Yes, one take all day. It was actually the fourth take. It's, no, was it? Number, oh, now they're ratting me out. Dave and I just flew all day. We've been up since 3 a.m. All this energy is completely sustained by a lot of caffeine right now. These gentlemen are gonna take us to do a whole bunch of cool stuff here in Texas. You know what, shout out to Texas. Texas is the second largest following state in the United States. I, hold on. The second the, biggest audience in the United States. There we go. So these gentlemen were kind enough to contact McLaren of Houston and say, you got anything for the DDE boys? And they said, come on over, check this out. This is a big dealership. Huge, right? biggest I've ever seen. Look at this, we got Skittles lined up for days out front. Thank you, sir. Yes. Welcome. Welcome. So right away off the bat, we came in and we noticed this two-tone, what do you call it? it like, uh, gradient? Gradient. gradient? Gradient, gradient. Like your sunglasses. Use the big words that I can't use because I have no education. Gradient. Gradient 720S. So this is a limited edition car. This car takes approximately 500 hours, man hours to paint this vehicle. What? And it's about, I forgot how many exact shades that you have to, that they lay down. It's an individual, very lightly, very, very lightly shaded paint. So if you go online, look it up. It's approximately, like I said, about, about 500 man hours. If we bought this car, we'd wrap the camel right away. Oh, <laughs> they would kill us. What'd you buy? We bought this special 720S and then we wrapped it and they're like, the guys in England are just like. Cool. Is that what it is? Yes, it's actually 86,000. Dude, this car is worth more than your life. I know, twice, twice yeah. over. Holy. Well, this is a beautiful car. When you see it here, and the way that you guys display it, you know, it's like a jewelry store. It's like a magic trick, you know? All the diamonds are sparkling. And just like Kevin's car, you guys, the 458 Challenge car, they have the McLaren 570, like, basically client race car. It's the GT4, right? Yeah. My, yeah. Nailed it. They're also quiet. I just show up with a camera and start yelling. This is what happens. I was kind of quiet when I first got in here. So <laughs> check it out. They got the air jacks. And I said, when they put this down, did this not crack the floor because it's on this beautiful yeah. tile? And well, they have a trick for that. They go said, slow. you, you go slow. slow. Go slow. Yeah. So, so now really look at this. They got race cars sitting in the showroom hovering. But look at this because race car, and we can open this up. So door handle on a 570 regularly is right here, but this one's up here. And by the way, the doors weigh like nothing. Yeah. Hey, Damon, hop in there. Yeah, no. Hop in there. Don't. Why not? Don't do this. <laughs> Get in there, Dave. Go, go, go. Watch your head. Watch your head. Don't watch your head. Oh, it's tight. Yeah, you definitely would not fit. No. I told you. Look at Dave. So Dave's squeezing in there. I'm in good shape. I'm in a good physique. You're in, in good. I'm also not you're skinny. Like no one said you're in good physique. Yeah. Look, at the, <laughs> look at the steering wheel. Oh, yeah. Pull the steering wheel off. You know how to do that, right? There you oh, go. Oh, yeah. This is like, this is straight up. This is like PlayStation or, you know, isn't it? Just like a little simulator. It is like simulator. The best is, these are so satisfying to click. GTRs. I don't know how he gets. He, he's a good salesman. Like one second, I'm looking at a 600 LT, and all of a sudden, he's like, "We got a P1." And then we've got a P1 GTR, and it went from what? The P1 you're selling is about one and a half mil, uh, Volcano Orange. But then all of a sudden, he's like, he he gets me from okay, what's this thing worth? 260. 260 to one and a half mil. Next thing you know, we're having a conversation like that 
for three and a half million dollars for a P1 GTR or four million or whatever. Anyhow, I can't afford it. Let's go. Show me the stuff that we're here to look at. So by the way, introduce yourselves. My name is Sean Seaman. I'm a general manager at McLaren Houston. And we have I'm Jennifer. Jennifer Moss and I'm sales experience manager here at uh, McLaren Houston. And these two young gentlemen. Travis, I'm the sales and service assistant here. So I help them out. Are you guys old enough to have driver's licenses? <laughs> I've actually had like four people ask me that while I was here. Dude, <laughs> get them out of the vlog. They're making me look older. Hey, we track hey? I just turned nervous. 40. You guys are killing me. This is like, look like my son. Oh, oh. oh. all right. Oh, now you can stay out. in. If you roast me within the first like 60 seconds of me coming through the door, you've earned my respect, my friend. They have a race car. So you have a GT3. This is a 12C yeah. GT3. So this is the first GT3 car based off of a road car McLaren. Wow. So they made 25 of these worldwide. This is chassis number 25 of 25. This is the one that was shown at Pebble Beach. At one point it was switched to a K&M spec and shown at Pebble Beach and turned around. It's been converted back to the Sprint package. Um, it's menacing looking. Dave. Dude, come here. What? Is this wood? It is wood. Yeah, it's yeah. Wood. You didn't know race cars put wood? And they yeah. put wood under the diffusers. No, I, how would I know that? Is that common so knowledge? Is, but no, I knew race cars legitimately use wood under their diffusers in areas that are cheap high impact. This is considered also a high impact area. Yeah. That's this the is wording. Artificial. It gets thrown away. Yeah. So it makes sense. Well, cheap. Just get a load impact. of like the engine. <laughs> That's not normal looking. A little different than your normal 12C. Yeah, a little. A little and this scoopy thing is pretty rad. The wing's super bad all carbon in fact this wing looks a lot i gotta give it to it this wing looks a lot like choi's wing hey the so way that it's got the extra little lip so this is move your car around that's boring you got anything better oh the snap holy yeah that's not this is like ps4 right here yep. oh dude and the grip is like it's like slime my kid plays with slime oh i see why my kid plays with slime this is really cool dude touch that not my hand don't touch my hand <laughs> Hey, I'm gonna order a drink. What do you guys want? Oh, I'm gonna get a martini. <laughs> this, it does say drink. It does. Would you see that? This is helmet. So you hook up your helmet and you can drink while you're driving. So that's <laughs> yeah, that's the button. Yeah, yeah. Like in the Senna. Yeah, it powers the, your helmet so you can push your drink. Pow, dude. Race technology. I'm gonna raise his PSI on his. Martini, 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 martini. <laughs> dude, you were pushing that button in the airplane all the way here. I was. Why'd you yell at the girl? <laughs> I was thirsty. <laughs> I was thirsty. Three pedals. Proper race car. Check this out. Again, because race car. So right here, you guys, air jacks. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Right? Yeah. And it's like, voila. Perfect. You guys, what do you think? Should we pull a Kevin and buy a race car? This thing's for sale, right? It is. It's for sale. Add it to the list. You guys, it's on the list. 675 LT, you guys. So now is this chicane gray? This is chicane gray. Yes, I actually got a paint code right. This is like, someone marked this down in the history of daily driven exotics. I screw up all paint codes, especially anything Italian because they're always like, you know, giallo, borealis, or some, I don't know. Boreala.
We're out of McLaren, Houston. If you need anything, give them a call. We'll be back, I'm sure. What a tour. What a fun first stop in Houston. Are you hungry? Let's go eat. Let's go eat. <laughs> okay, guys. See you guys. Chat soon. We are, by the way, in a 350R in the rain. In the rain. I'm definitely trusting this guy with my life right now. Hey, Dave, you want to swap? Nope. I'll go, no, nope. uh, no, 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 I want to go in the, I want to go in the all-wheel drive car. All right, here we go. You guys, listen to this thing. Listen. This thing sounds so good, like soft. Totally saving us right now. Yeah. It's slick out. So how much horsepower does a 350R have again? It's 526 down to the crank, so in the 400 still wheel. So, so sick and it's light. So what is this place? BJ's. Hold on, where are you taking us? Uh, Safe. I Florida. like Texas. Oh, no <laughs> what? That was great. Brew house. Oh, I'm so oh, stuff. Oh, I'm stuff. Dude, bad. it's Texas. Yeah. Your guys' portions are like. The menu is this thick. A yeah. Everything was this thick. It was a dictionary. I was on a diet. I ate a cookie and ice cream. <laughs> Dude, if you get pulled over and we're in the hotel room, I'm going to be so mad. Oh, he really is following he you. He is following you. You can he see it in the really mirror. following me. I can't make if he pulls into my neighborhood, I'm gonna be pissed. He's straight up. There's a suburban. There's a suburban cop following him. Oh my god, he's turning with me. Look at this. I cannot make that up. <laughs> do not put that phone down, soldier. Yeah, do not put that phone down, soldier. Look, look, watch, watch. His lines are gonna pull behind me. And oh my god. He's totally following you. I'm being literally followed right now. You see that? Just just, just pull over somewhere and see what happens. What happens if you just pulled over on the side of the road? Would he pull in behind you and turn his lights on? Hell yeah. No, nah, he'd probably pass me. No. Try it. Try it. 50-50. You guys crazy. got money? You got any money? Money, the money that he will get pulled over. Money he will get pulled over? You? I'll, I'll take that money. I would I take the money that to. you get pulled over. Let's see. Pull over and see if he'll drive by you. Now this is just, we just turned this into a game. <laughs> Oh, Comment oh, below shit. as you get pulled over. <laughs> yeah. And he went past me. Oh. Okay, we're trying not to get Tony's car impounded, but we are cruising back to the hotel. And for whatever reason, that's Blake. Blake's in the Huracan. It's a 580 2. Blake wants to race. But if you line up here, apparently Houston is like the town of, of street racing, right? Yep. So all the cops, all they do is they look for cars that are lined up side by side, which is essentially what he was doing. So that's probable cause just to take you to jail. Probable cause just to take you to jail. Yeah. Look across this fucking whole parking lot it's is right across. That's the mall we were just at. Look at this. We pulled into the parking lot. We we're like, 
Why is the radar going off all of a sudden like crazy? Check this out. One, two, and there's another one on the other side. <laughs> Oops. All right, you guys. What a start to our Houston trip. Dude, what a start to the Houston <laughs> trip. That was awesome. What's up? Give a shout out. What's your name? Jacob. Jacob. Man, Texas. Jacob is freaking out. We, we were at Denny's. We were done. Wondering why the police leave their trucks running while they have breakfast. And he jumps out of the car, losing shit. He's actually being very calm right now. I'm, I'm, now I'm being calm. Are you gonna go eat breakfast? No, I'm, I'm going home. <laughs> you just, that's it? Damon's not room my whole night. <laughs> I'm not even hungry no more. Yep, I'm going home. Hey, yep, going thank home. you for watching, brother. Always, brother. I'll see you Saturday morning. Yes, sir. Nice to meet you. Your car is awesome. Thanks for. That was awkward, but it's all good. <laughs> hey, good to meet you. Are you going to come out tomorrow? Too, yes, sir. You guys, smash that subscribe button. Dave and I are going to go enjoy our Spring Hill Suites. I'll see you guys in the next one. You want some DD merch? ShopDD.com. Link in description. I'll see you tomorrow. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.